Okay, here we go. We're going to try this again without the moonlighting effect. That was the show, without the moonlighting effect. Hey everybody, good morning and welcome to Monday. What is today? June the 10th. Today we're going to talk about uh, opportunity, risk, and reward and why you should be grateful to have risk in your life. Yeah, we'll talk about that right after this. This is 7 Minutes in the Morning, where five days a week you get tips and hacks dedicated to helping business owners and leaders just like you find and break through the one thing that is preventing your success. And now, here's the host of 7 Minutes in the Morning and your results coach, Tom Rigsby. Yes, indeed, and the result we're looking for today is to get rid of that humidity halo that was around my head. Just had to let it cook off. I don't know, it got inside the lens of the camera. But hey, thank you for being here, uh, Catherine and Joe. Glad both of you made it back. Appreciate that. If you are watching, whether you're watching live or on the replay, do what Joe and Catherine have done. Leave me a comment. Say good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever is appropriate for you. And uh, I just always like to see those and know when you guys are here. So I'm going to go ahead and jump right into it since we're running a little bit behind this morning, but <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> there is no risk-free path to success. That's, that's the, uh, the title I wanted to work with this morning because way too often we get this idea that we should take the, the risk-free path. Or I've even heard a lot of people say, in fact, I had a, a very um, passionate discussion with a boss of mine one time about it, how he said he was risk averse. And I said, then you'll never create anything new. And he disagreed with that. And of course, I totally agree with that. The point here is that if, if you are presented with an opportunity and there, and remember, an opportunity is just a set of circumstances. So there's not necessarily going to be a big bow on it that says, ding dong, hey, here's opportunity. Today is a brand new set of circumstances. So you have an opportunity. If you are presented with an opportunity that there is no risk attached to, then that's not really an opportunity to do, to, to, to make exponential growth. That's just it's it's a gift it really is ding dong here you go right real reward requires real risk in fact I, I think I said somewhere that the that those valuable the most valuable rewards are hiding behind risk we have to go through risk to get to the reward and so just like you know yesterday's Instagram post where I talked about you know we should we should acknowledge fear for what it is and be open to experiencing it because that means we're on, we're going in the right direction fear is your body your mind telling you to pay attention and if you are fearful if there is risk then that means you are going in the right direction it doesn't mean to be reckless Oh, there's a bunch of risks. We should just go that way. No, you can mitigate those risks, and you should. You should think about them, what you can do to, uh, to mitigate them. Do you have to go that way, or maybe is there a different way that you can go and still get the same result? But fear and risk are all indicators that you are heading in the right direction. Right? And the greatest rewards, I said a minute ago, the reward hide, hides behind the risk. The greatest reward hides behind the biggest risk. And that is why we reward risk takers in, in our society. Right, The ones that are willing to go take the risk are the ones that are going to get the greatest reward. And rightfully so, because they've put the most on the line. That's it. It's, it's not any more complicated than that. When you see risk, you know you're headed in the right direction. So don't run away from it. Don't, don't say, I'm risk averse. <clears throat> and look, I, I used to have this line about entrepreneurs are not risk junkies. We're just more comfortable operating in risky environments. You have to realize, see the risk for what it is, realize it, realize what it is, and move forward anyway. 
That's why I had that quote last week from John Wayne, you know, about courage is saddling up anyway, even when you're afraid. Can't demonstrate fear in the ab or courage in the absence of fear. We have to have courage to move forward and to attack risk because risk is where the rewards are. All right, that's it for today. I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up. Thanks so much for sticking in there with me this morning while the camera cooked off and warmed up. I'll uh, I'll see if I can't get that warmed up a little bit earlier tomorrow. And hey, listen, if this has been valuable for you or you know someone that could benefit from it, I would appreciate it if you'd do two things for me. One, give me the old thumbs up, likes, hearts, whatever is appropriate in the venue where you are watching and listening. And number two, share this with someone or in your network or your home network, whatever you feel is appropriate. I will be back. Yeah, Joe, yeah, Joe, you're spot on there. Simple, simple concept that requires a significant amount of effort to achieve. That's a fact. All right, you guys have a great Monday. Talk to you again tomorrow. Take care.